video I'm gonna show you how you can make a blurring in or blurring out picture or photo in flash using macromedia flash professional Edit. so first step I have to do is to click on file then I have to click on import and import to stage uh, scenery just like I want a Mark Zuckerberg like then you have to click open and now you have to click on the free transform tool to reside it and uh, just like that I want at the middle so you have to you, you can use your cursor key on keyboard or you can also use your mouse just like that so the next step you have to do is to right click on the photo and then convert to symbol and then you can name it like whatever you want mark Taj whatever you so next step you have to click on um, ok so and next uh, more step is you have to take three more keyframe just like here like if you want a little long time to take like you want a long time to blur in and blur out then you can make your point over here but if you want really short then you need to be really close like this one now you have to click on the right uh, right key on your mouse and now you have to insert a keyframe and you also have to do again like here uh, and then you also again you have to insert a keyframe just like that so it depends on you like where you want uh, a blurry image like I want at the uh, middle so I have to click middle frame then I have to click on photo and now I have to click on this little triangle just here so the option will appear on my screen now if I uh, next step is I have to go on the filter then you can see a little bit uh, plus sign you have to click it then you have to go on the blur and now you can see as I press this thing uh, a little triangle and I have to move up so the image become more blurry and as I go down then Im image become more clear so uh, it depends on you how much blurry you want so but I want uh, 27 or 27 around just like that so everything is from here have done uh, now I have to just close it down and now I have to just create motion you have to click up between this uh, place like between your two point like this one and this one I have to click at the middle and then I have to right click and I have to create motion twin like here and the same as also here so as you can see as I move this you can see blurry blurring or blur out and if I click control press enter then it will be continuing doing all those things what I am still trying to say you right now so that is the result so if but if you want more than just that then you can also add another layer you have to click insert layer here then you can click on this and you have to drag it down here and then you have to click the first frame just like this now you can use any billboard at the background and you can place this picture over there but uh, but in this case I want a DSLR camera and I want that photo be on this or uh, actually on that so just like that now I have to resize it uh, this DSLR photo and uh, just like that now I have to go on the upper above layer and I have to also resize it just like that it will take a little bit time but after it it will be awesome like you also have to make it good so now you have to, you have to make sure that you click on the photo then you will be able to resize it uh, just like that just one second and it will be it will look awesome and you also have to do this thing on every layer if you are trying to do after you have done blurring blur out so just like that if you want more than only you have to do this thing otherwise everything is okay whatever you was around so again last one you also have to do the same now again I have to do just a little bit over here just like that it will take a little bit time uh, just like perfect so if you click on control press enter then you can see the result how it works here so it will look like I am focusing through my camera so here it wraps up if you want any other thing from about or about regarding to flash professional aid or micrometer professional aid then you can just comment down whatever you think about so here it wraps up I will see you in another video see ya bye